I pinpointed something that a lot of people didn't know that um, in 1965 Bobby had an operation to re remove a testicle oh. because he had cancer. And uh, as long ago as 65. That, yeah. Be like so before the 66 final. And so what can you imagine that today? You know, we we as pressmen kept it quiet. Yeah, did you? Just, just a handful of us knew. But in those days, you, you whispered cancer. You, it was yeah, a word you didn't right. use. True, true. But, I didn't uh, know that. But can you imagine how much a bigger hero Bobby would have been? You know, if, if they'd have known, the, the, so I think it was 18 months after his operation, there he is lifting the Jules Rimet trophy, which was the World Cup. Well, his, his weaknesses were, were many. Um, he, he was uh, as slow as a card horse. He couldn't head a ball. But he was the greatest reader of a game there's ever been. And he would be in the right position at the right time before anybody else had realised the position even existed. He, he, he was as astonishing in being able to think ahead right. of what was actually happening. We, we mere mortals, would be watching the ball and Bobby would be looking for space. And uh, he followed the advice that Malcolm Allison gave him as a 16-year-old. Just think, always say to yourself, what would I do if the ball came to me now? And uh, that, that's a good thing for, for youngsters to know to do now. What would I do if the ball came to me now? So therefore you're prepared at all times. And Bobby was always prepared.